Okay, let me resume. Let me see. So who's next in line for the throne if Lady Halbender has an accident? Perhaps she is immortal. Nobody's immortal. Not even death herself. I can't believe you just said that with a straight face. Groot says we should check things out over here. Give me a bridge here. The fortress is right on the other side of those cliffs. So, what do we do if all don't go well with Lady A? And if all pretty sure it's this way. Then we'll know we should have sold through the set. Easy is rarely work. Yep. For you, maybe. I love you. Oh, no, it ain't. What did the tree say? Says all this moisture is good for us and will make us grow. In your case, that is doubtful. I agree with Groot. It's important to stay hydrated. Not this hydrated. Hey. That looks interesting. Oh, this is the stuff that I haven't unlocked. Hey, what's going on? It's five horsemen of the apocalypse. of one lousy source. Guys, every misstep was just a step in the right direction towards completing our best plan yet. Say that again? What if we brought one of those ugly suckers all the way here only to find out Lady H already had a full set? That would have sucked big time. Exactly. If we even got that far. What if we'd been towing that thing when Nova Corps intercepted us? Well, let's just get this done. Dramatic rodents. Bridge ends at the fortress, therefore it is not perfect. Yeah, that's super comforting. Guess we gotta go. Three cycles. Peter? Aren't you forgetting something? Are you? Oh, right. Cage. One of you can get the flark and then he's looking like a new business. 
All right, Rocket. Time to put on your monster face. I only got one face, Quill. Are you sure about this, Peter? <laughs> Look at him. You better have one hell of a sales pitch. me again how many missions have we been on so far 13 14 if you count contracts contracts yeah was not a mission it was a mistake all right point is is i was able to sell you gamora daughter of thanos intergalactic assassin as a hero 14 times <laughs> fine i think he's made his point <laughs> Drat. Gamora, can you help me with no. this? What? Why? To guarantee your safety as a leader. Ah, oh, come on. <laughs> She's got you there, Quill. Now shut up and start pulling. Can you stop worrying so much? You're gonna start growing knots again. Okay, here we go. Someone else wants to pull this thing. We are 60 clicks from the fortress. I'd say closer to 75. Well, there is only one way to know for sure. 0 0.1 clicks. 0 0.2 clicks. 0 0.9. 2.1. 0 0.3 clicks. 4.5. 0 0.4 clicks. 0 0.5 clicks. 0 0.66 clicks. clicks. Flashback time. Thirteen whole years. Look at you. Where does time go? I'll be up in a sec, I promise. Right. <laughs> I didn't think you'd actually come up. Maybe being on time is my new thing. Oh, right. We'll see about that when I have to get you up for school tomorrow. You know, I think I'm too old for that, too. Nice try, smart Alec. Sit. Don't worry, I'm not gonna sing. I liked your singing. Well, you might be the only one. Go on, make a wish. You're officially a teenager. all those girlfriends. Someone's gonna be really popular at school. Mom. What? You are very handsome. I'm sure all the girls are gonna be falling off. Mom. On. What did you wish for? Why would I wish for anything? I've got everything I want. <laughs> oh, what huge favor are you about to ask me? Just 10 bucks. Dan, Andy, and I wanna go see Night of the Cosmos at the Rio tonight. 
a movie. Tonight. Come on. It's gonna be sick. It's about these zombies that invade Earth, and then it's up to these kids that have to blow them away. I don't think I want you to see that, Peter. I let you watch the hockey mask one, and you were sleeping in my bed the next three nights. You watched The Exorcist when you were younger than me. Of course you would remember that. And then I ask you if you packed your lunch and you give me a blank stare. No, I just, I, I wanted us to have some us time tonight, you know? Maybe finish our game. You can't duck out right when I'm about to win. We can still do all that stuff. Or some of it. Tomorrow. You're always telling me to get out of the house more. A movie theater does not count as out of the house, and you know it. Pretty please? I don't know. Truck's still in the shop, and I don't want you walking alone in the dark. There's been a lot of weirdos out there. It's not safe. I'll be careful, Ma. I always am. Were you careful when you got that black eye? I told you I, I was... I know! You were standing up for someone, which is a good thing. But you cannot go punching your way out of every problem, Peter. I couldn't just stand there. No. Of course not. Okay, get me my purse. Not so fast. Before you go, there's something I want to talk to you about, something I want to give you. 20 bucks? Don't push it. Think of it as a long overdue gift from your father. It's upstairs on my bed. Go on and get it while I finish up in the kitchen. And we can open it together. You dare touch that dial. <laughs> Shoot! Mom told me to put the laundry away two days ago. I'll do it first thing in the morning. Scout's honor. Hand still stings from catching Mom's fastball. Wonder if she got me a new glove for my birthday. My pants didn't do much better than my eye in that fight. Gotta remember to give this to Andy later. You know, he was a pretty good sport about not putting the Star-Lord patch on his jacket, too. We'd have looked like complete dorks if we both had it. Hey, Kubrick, buddy. No matter how long you wait here for Grandma and Grandpa, they're not coming back. Sorry. Mom's pretty close to winning this game. Little guy put up a big fight. Wouldn't have been able to land him without Grandpa's tricks. finally got my hair the way I like it. Sometimes grandma and grandpa would let me sleep with them if I was too afraid down in the basement. I miss them so much. Grandma used to take me into town on Sundays to run errands. We'd stop for ice cream on the way home, even in winter. I don't know much about art, but I know that this is excellent. Grandma really had talent. 
I know it sounds crazy, but mom's convinced my dad was an alien. She really believes it. Mm -hmm. Could she be right? Yep. The sky is clear. I wonder if mom will spend the night stargazing since I'm heading to the movie. Sure, it'd be nice to believe there are other worlds out there, but what are the odds? Pretty slim, I bet. Fancy's every UFO sighting is really a weather balloon or a bright star. But there's so many of them. Couldn't a few be real? Gonna have to get Mom to show me how to shoot. Grandpa was supposed to this summer. Meredith Quill, perfect game. Not bad. Right, that's everything. Let me grab this. At last. Huh? Hey, what was in the box? Exactly invested in my safe return. My skin, my plan. Your call, Peter. The Clark, it is. I'm the one in the box, lady. Peter Quill is our leader. The burden of your possible death falls on his shoulders. Fully on board with Rocket's plan that I was totally paying attention to. See? Even Captain Space Cadet. <laughs> Wait, God what about coming. gymnastics? I just think we shouldn't be relying on a piece of tech you won't even yes, be around to use. To it out. has neutrino splicing. It's a tracker. Even you mouth breathers can figure it out. Name? Guardians of the Galaxy. Never heard of you. Bonafide monster sellers. Today, anyway. What's in the box? A monstrous abomination from half -World and the meanest SOB in the quadrant. Pass. Pass? Rocket. I mean... Things puny. It is a hell beast, the namesake of your mistress. You'd be wise to reconsider. All right, get going before I change my mind. And if the lady don't like it, I'll be carting out what's left of you in that box. Hell beast? It is an accurate moniker. The little beast has a hellish demeanor. I like it. Not exactly an easy way out if this all goes to hell. It's gonna go great. We got a killer monster and a solid plan. I would show more caution, Peter Quill. If Lady Hellbender realizes our deceit, her vengeance will be swift. What? I'm supposed to be scared just because she's got hell in her name? She runs a glorified zoo. That's no zoo. The monster queen has a monster army. Any chance of the zookeepers with guns? I have never seen one of those tamed. I have seen one trample a man to pulp. It's fine. If worst comes to worst, we hightail it for the Milano. Your genius plan is run away? Backup plan? Which we're not gonna need, but yeah. It's not like she can chase after us with her old monster mash. <clears throat> oh, come on. Why did we not simply dock here and avoid the threats of hospital surface? Because Quill flies like a one-eyed badoon. We needed time to iron out the plan. Now it's foolproof. Lady Hellbender is no fool. When her monster goes missing, she'll assume it was us. Assume, yes, but not no. Not chases across the galaxy level of no, at least. Wow. Look at this place. I'm in the wrong line of work. It is appropriately impressive for a warrior of Lady Hellbender's stature. Someday, that's gonna be our <laughs> Of yours. Focus, guys. Time to get those game faces on. He means you gotta sell the illusion, too. Exactly. Kaleran scum. That is truly a priceless trade for gold. Explained the vault. Priceless? Vault? Screw the sneaking around. Let's pull off a good, honest heist. No! no! Lady Hellbender's throne. If she chooses to approach 
you, you will remain still. No erratic movements. I know what you meant. Do not claim it. You are not the first to claim they have captured a Tara Tara. You, you doubt its authenticity? It is what you say it is. Prove it. Or suffer the consequence of every other would be con artist. I assure you. I said, Milady. release it. Got this. the next seller and transfer 10,000 units to that last one's next of He's dead. <laughs> hey there, I'm Star-Lord. Okay. Drax the Destroyer. <laughs> the undoing of the Mad Titan in the flesh. And such flesh. Presence honors me. You are much smaller than I expected. Oh? <laughs> and what were you expecting? Perhaps I can do something about it. But uh, unlikely. We'll see, Destroyer. I can be quite forceful. She is flirting with me. <laughs> um, just play along, man. Flatter her or something. You got this. This for the best. Your negotiation skills are terrible. Lady Hellbender. I can see by the size of your weapon that you must be a skillful warrior. Hmm. Perhaps <laughs> I can give you a demonstration sometime. You would make an acceptable opponent. Tell me, Destroyer, what brings you to Sagnarf 9? Peter Quill, show her the creature. <laughs> Drax speaks funny. Oh, it's about forking time. <laughs> oh, what is it? it? It has a name, lady. And it talks adorable. <laughs> Quill made stop. <laughs> when will it reach its big size? Big size? Yeah, I wouldn't pet him like that again unless you want to lose a finger. He bites hard. I admire a creature with some spirit. What would you call it? It is a hell beast. 
doesn't look like much. <sighs> if I didn't know any better, I'd think it was a woodland creature. True, but do we mention it's one of a kind? Just look deep into those angry raccoon eyes. I ain't a freaking raccoon! And you'll see that there's a monster in there. Big, scary, trigger-happy monster. And what would you like for the... Hell Beast? 20,000 units. Twenty thousand. And not a penny less. Twenty thousand? Uh, wow, okay. See, I was thinking more like twelve. No. Nine then. Uh, the creature is worthless to me. <sighs> I would rather buy the Flora Colossus. Told you. What? You want to buy Groot? Is he for sale? No, he ain't. Just think of the money, Rocket. I am Quill. And Groot's not for sale. What are you doing? Land me, Quill. Guys, he's gone mad. I'm not even doing it right. Um. Let's check. Um, I don't know.
You can't be serious. Even Peter's not that suicidal. You want to cut and run, or do you want to get paid? We don't have time to argue. Hellbender's goons are going to be here any second. Quill's right. Shut your traps and follow me. Not what I'm saying. Let's just find the big elevator we came in on and get the hell out. No wonder we're always poor. You saps don't know how to take what's yours. Not much weight to pull. I see. Abilities. Actually. Vault's 
right there. We smash and grab, and like Will said, out the way we came. 5,000 units to the Hellraiser who kills the so-called Guardians of the Galaxy. Okay, people, let's do this. One catastrophe at a time. Oh, sucker! Suck on this! Nice work, Peter! Tough guys. Lady Hellbender should face us herself. How about if no one faces us? You struggle in pain. Next time, try fighting your tongue, Rocket. Instead of sticking your foot in your mouth, nobody crosses me. Saying thanks. Gratitude is not my current sentiment. More like murderous rage. Just admit it, Rocket. We had a plan and you blew it. The plan was blown the minute it crawled out of your brain. I saved the plan. You do not get credit for salvaging your own blunder. The blunder was putting our lives in his grubby little hands. I knew we should have gone with Groot. Groot ain't some piece of lumber you can hawk. Though I'm sure you got plenty of experience trafficking lies. Watch your tongue or I'll cut it out. Oh, I'm shaking, lady. You bring a knife to a gunfight. Groot says you can all go sit on a hot poker. Oh, fine, fine. You're all against me. But by the end, you'll be lining up to kiss my hairy paws. I knew we shouldn't have sold that barking rat. Who are you calling a rat? He was clearly referring to you, am I correct? Mm, nice. That one looks nice. No.
Yeah, that one looks sick. Yeah, it's tacky. Bits? Joke's on you. I don't even wear shoes. Everybody quiet! Come on! What got the lava for what? Perfect. It means we're headed the right way. Straight into an ambush. Just another by the numbers plan for the Guardians of the Galaxy. What we should have done is sold tracks. Hellbender was practically begging to buy an egg with a big gold. My gift is not for sale. The house pest still owes us 12,000 units. 12? How'd you get 12? It's a measure of my growing frustration. Well, take a deep breath, cause we're here. One vault as promised. And a giant locked door. Leave that to me. Heads up! Ambush! Yeah! We're ambushing them! <laughs> These Hellboys are really putting up a fight! Nothing a scuttload of units won't fix. Make your peace! Into this one, she's stuck on repeat. Feel this? This reminds me of this current battle. I'd rather be there right now. I can't believe we actually made it. I never had a doubt. Ah, oh, missed. Ready! Punch it, Drax! <laughs> what is next, Peter Quill? I am increasing your debt! Guys, huddle up! This is kind of was an accident. No, well, let me see if I can do it. Blind or something? Me and I see perfectly well abomination, and you two are getting in the way of my victory. Us? You're the one screwing up our fun. Me and Groot stand a better chance of winning this on our own. on the wrong thing. One doesn't come from flying solo. It comes from shredding them up in perfect harmony together. Who's with me? I am with you, Peter. Let's do this! Great! What's next, Peter? Cut to pieces! Getting out of here is gonna be a nightmare! It's not a nightmare. We are clearly awake. Destroy! I can't believe we actually made it! Getting here is the easy part! Rip him a new one! Death has come! This is exactly why we should have gone with Groot! Not my best choice, I get it! I am adding 50 units to your debt, Conan! You'll get it back as soon as we're in Make it fast. Of course. There ain't a lock this side of Xandar I can't pop. I am adding to your debt for every extra minute this takes. Keep your manis on. You can't rush genius. All hell raises to the main vault. Or I could try rushing and hope for the best. Let's get to the Big guy! 
Why am I not hitting that? They're just lights and they look heavy as scut. Right, it's ran a bit long. Um, I'm gonna wrap it up and I'll receive in the next one. Peace.